What's up everyone, Clayton here, and today I'm back with another Skyrim How to Find. It's been a while since I've done one of these, and uh, this one's going to be kind of short. Uh, and pretty much we're going to be going for a weapon here at the Bloated Man's Grotto. Uh, this is located kind of by the plains of Whiterun. Uh, you can see on the map here some of the locations surrounding it. And the weapon we're going for is, I think it's Bolard's Oath Blade. It's a blade that's kind of... Uh, in the line of bla blades, you know, the uh, defenders of the emperor and such before they got taken out. It kind of looks like one of those, and it, uh, it looks really cool and has a special enchantment, but we'll get back to that later. Um, pretty much, uh, this area, Bloodman's Grotto, there's another quest linked to this called Ill Met by Moonlight. And if you do that quest first, it kind of glitches the... Uh, the sword, I guess you could say. You have to wait a month of in-game time before you can come back and get the sword. Uh, so, if you've done that quest, it might mess it up a little bit, but you can always come back and check and see if it works. Pretty much, it's a pretty straightforward uh, dungeon. It's kind of like open foresty area inside this cave. Uh, there's a lot of bears. Um, and right here behind me, a Spriggan Earth Mother spawns. Which is a pretty high level Spriggan. This is my level 81, so that's why it's such a high level. It might just be a Spriggan. Excuse me. Uh, it might just be a Spriggan for you. It just depends on your level. But anyways, you come up these stairs, and you will see the sword and a piece of paper located uh, right below a shrine of Talos. And uh, the piece of paper has a little inscription where it says, To he who finds this, know that I... Aclarius Bolar, the last of the blades to survive the attack on Cloud Ruled Templar, Templar, Temple, took refuge here in this ancient sanctuary. The Thalmor have come for me, but they will shall not desecrate this place. I go forth to meet my death with honor. If you're worthy, take up my blade and do the same. So yeah, it's kind of kind of cool. Gives a little backstory of who Blor Bolar is, and here is his blade as a pretty good enchantment. Uh, it gives 25 points of stamina damage, and creatures and people are feared uh, from a combat if you're uh, level 12 or below. Um, yeah, so it's a pretty good weapon, and I, I recommend. I really like the looks of these blades, uh, kind of like the Dragon Blade, uh, Dragon Bane uh, weapon you get during the main storyline. And I don't think there's very many places you can find this style of sword, so I would really make, recommend picking it up uh, for improving this weapon uh, you will need a quick silver ingot as well as to increase it further you'll need a steel smithing perk and also since it is enchanted you will need the arcane blacksmith perk uh, because that's the only way you can upgrade enchanted uh, items and yeah I think I look I'm gonna go here and swing it around a little bit and I really like it it's a pretty good sword if you want to pick this up for yourself uh, go ahead and uh, this is gonna be one of the uh, kind of my comeback on YouTube, I guess, uh, making more videos. I've got time to record a couple, so I did that today. So you can see those coming out over the next couple of days. And so anyways, uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. And uh, this is Clayton, uh, signing off.